Hello everybody, I am Dark Ace, and today I am going to be playing The Legend of Zelda Twilight Princess. I just want to do this first intro to talk about this. It, I'm mainly doing this for a friend who's never seen this. Um, but I have my own YouTube channel, so I decided just to play games play this and then I'll do another game and so forth but um yeah like I, I played Gears of War 3 a few episodes but that didn't turn out the way I wanted it to so I deleted those um and I, I always did want to play this one for my first one and now it's coming true <gasps> oh it's so awesome wait what happened to Link why is he you know a wolf. The Legend of Zelda. Toilet Princess. Yeah, yeah. Start. Um, I made this new quest. Let's see, this is the first time I played. 57 hours, 51 minutes. That one I didn't finish it. And I forgot where I was. So, anyway. Let's do that. And. Complete. So I tried this over and over again, I turned down the brightness of this, but I couldn't handle it, so I just turned down the brightness of my tablet, and it's working fine. Tell me, do you ever feel a strange sadness as dusk falls? Not really. They say it's the only time when our world intersects with theirs. Theirs. The only time when we can feel anger and regrets of spirits who have left our world. This is why loneliness always pervades the hour of twilight. But enough talk of sadness. I have a favor to ask of you, Link. I was supposed to deliver something to the royal family of Hyrule the day after tomorrow. I didn't just say two days from now. Yes, it was a task set to me by the mayor, but would you go in my stead? I have to. You have... Never been to Hyrule, right? In the kingdom of Hyrule, there is a great castle, and around it is, ca is Castle Town, a community far bigger than our little tiny village. I don't think, yeah, never mind, I do. Uh, and far bigger than Hyrule is the rest of the world the gods created. You should look upon it with all. All, at all with your own eyes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It is getting late. We should head back to the village. I will talk to the mayor about this matter. Everything's red. In the screen. To me it is, anyway. music like I said this is one of my I didn't say that I don't think but this is one of my favorite Zelda, or it is my favorite Zelda game and one of my favorite Zelda games one of my favorite games of all time <laughs> I can't speak English today need to go back to school. Oh yeah, speaking of that, I do go back to school tomorrow. Yay! Seventh grade. Lovely. Why is that? That's a boy we do something do later. No spoilers. <laughs> Who's that? Hey, what are you doing? No. She kidnapped our horse. Call 911. Police. We have a kidnap. I was going to say murder. Hey, Link, you there?
Hey, you mind helping me herd the goats? They ain't listening to me lately. Listening to me lately. Boink, 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 boink. Hey, where's the Epona? So that means we have to go that way. Plus, oh, we can't go that way. Can. I said can. Shut up. Link looks fat in these clothes. Just look at those. Anyway. And we can pick up rocks. We can collect a rupee. We can throw rocks. What am I going to do? I'm going to do this. Just watch. See, I had my brightness turned down on my TV, but it didn't work out. I couldn't see very well, so I turned it back up and just turned the thing back down. I think I said that. Hell yeah. Except with their lips. I never noticed that before. Oh, hi Link. I washed your pona for you. Oh, you probably didn't. You just probably just did that. What are you doing like a foot away from her? So I can speak with her. Pony's a girl too, so you have to treat her nice like one. Oh, but listen, Link, could you do something for me? Can you use a piece of grass to play that song for me? You know, the one that Epona likes. Why do I have to do everything? Pick up. If you can hear that, that's Epona's song from Ocarina of Time and made Majora's Mask. But do but I won't be playing too many Zelda games on this channel. The only one I might play is Ocarina of Time Master Quest, which is like a harder version of Ocarina of Time. And I'll be playing that blind, basically. Which means it'll be my first time playing it. Or Ord on Village. Practicing with the sword. Just want to come this way. That's basically how she sounds. You go over here in such a hurry, Link. These guys have been awful skittish lately. They won't listen to a word I say. Sorry to ask, but, but how's about you and your opponent herd them up into the barn real quick? We ain't got much time, so you think you can do it for me? Nah. Much obliged there, bud. Okay, then go on and herd all these little scamps into the barn for me. So I learned a trick you can do. You actually make them face the right direction. And then, huh! I just made them go, I guess. Huh! Not that way. Oh, two. Go. Turn. Around. Turn, mister. Huh. Huh. But um, yeah, yeah. Link, Capone, much obliged, both of y'all. 
I can cover everything tomorrow without having to trouble you, so you can just sit back and relax, bud. Oh, but, um, how about today? Wanna practice with the fences? This way to spell bud, and I'll get them fences up. You're horrible at English. English lesson. Lesson. Who? sorry, that took so long. Okay, then y'all ride all you want. Y'all get tired of riding, just jump the gate and head back into the village, okay, bud? Just head over and jump. Can't. Doesn't go at an angle. Ugh. Doesn't go at an angle. There. You happy, Epona, huh? Jeez. Can't go at an angle. Even though you want it to. What the fudge? No, I don't want to save. Oh, yeah, nine minutes. Oh, I'm fast at this game. Not really, though. I understand. You can go away now. My horrible singing voice. Hey, wake up, Link. It's morning already. It is? Why didn't anyone tell me? business, y'all. <sighs> Screw walking down the ladder. Oh, gosh. Screw walking down the ladder. You can just backflip. Oh, wait. Did you hear? They're selling the swing shot at the store right now. A swing shot. I wonder how powerful it is. I, I need, I must try it. Tell if you and Mal want it so madly, just buy it at my parents' shop. Do you see any rupees in my hand? I can't afford that thing. Come on, Beth. Can't you just loan it to us for a while? You know, I've gotten a lot of trouble for that. If you two want to save up your allowances or something. But our allowances are terrible. Oh, I wish I was born in a family with a slingshot instead of one with a water wheel. So, of course, those little scamps want us to get the freaking slingshot. Take that. Oh, ouch. Headshot. Uh. Ouch. It broke on her head. Surprised she didn't get knocked out. Anyway, it's in here. See, there's a slingshot right there. But. Oh. Oh. Oh my, it's young Link. Welcome, my dear. You, you didn't happen to see my little cat out there, did you? He ate the fish we were going to have for supper last night, and I gave him a good scolding, and then he went out and hasn't returned. I'm so fraught with worry for him. I'm adjusted myself. So, it looks like she's not going to sell a slain shop. We have to get it by ourselves. Isn't that lovely? You have to do everything by yourself in Zelda. What's this guy want? Huh? Well, hey, Link. Got the day off from work today. Not me. The wife's hassling me. Today is restocking day at the store. See? Look. See that upon that tree? You can get any day. But that's not. But I need to know. And yeah. I'm thinking of knocking down that nest of Ordon bees. Our cat hasn't come home since yesterday, so the wife's in a bad mood. At the very least, I need her to bring something home. What?
Bye. Oh, jeez. Eek, ack, ouch, ow. Oh. They don't hold back with the standing, do they? Got him in the eye. I guess rots won't work. <laughs> Have fun in there. Hope you drown. Yo, Wink. Yo, up here. I want to talk to you. Press A while. I pressed it. There. Hey. There you go. Over here. Yeah, your voice carries well as usual. Voice? Have you seen me talking? Maybe you can teach my tights that you've got to press A while they're in da ba ba. Wait, they have GameCube controllers too? Wow, I thought this was like toward medieval times. Yo, there you are. Check this out. You see Sarah, you know Sarah at the demo store? Well, it isn't that her cat over there. He's just been sitting there next to the, at my house having a staring contest with the creek. Don't you suppose he's thinking he's gonna catch a fish, do you? Ha ha ha, I can't, I can't catch no fish. Anyway, that's not what I was meaning to tell you about. I was want you to take a look at something. See that grass growing there? Yeah, I have papa. I figured I was pretty rare to see it growing in a place like that, so I thought I'd let you know. I bet you can hop across these rocks with a quick little... Couldn't you? Hmm, gotta line myself. I gotta help this guy too, so I'm doing this first. Gotta help him because he can't figure this out. Oh no, bird's gonna attack me! Oh no. Do they have a little pointer? Just point it. Right there, and then go and knock it down. Wait, what is it? I'm not going to speak to him. He's still in the water, drowning. Okay. Well, I have to pick this. What's that monkey doing? So basically there's a monkey holding a cradle which allows you to do something to pass in the game, but you'll see. So there's a monkey and he usually grabs the cradle and brings it to you, but the first time I played this he ran into the monkey and, dro and the monkey dropped the cradle. So I had to swim all the way over there and get it and come back and swim back with it. That was awesome. Anyway, when I talk to this lady, oh my, Wink, I have been looking for that cradle. I made it with my first, when my first child was born and I have cherished it all these years. Did you know, what, did you know all this somehow? Did you find it and bring it back to me on purpose? My thanks to you. That reminds me, there is something I'm supposed to give you. Do you think I can, you can carry the cradle and come with me back to my house? Ooh, yeah, I can. What you gonna give me? My thanks to you, Wink. Yes, yes, I have forgotten I'm supposed to give you this. Alright, here you go. Oh, it's a fishing rod. Dang it, I don't like fishing rods. Especially this one. I'm surprised it doesn't break. It is a little unpolished. My son Colin made this under the instruction of his father. You can use it if you like. Nah, I don't like it. Take it back. Take it back. When my son Colin grows up, I want him to be just like him. I'm not a boy. Oh, man. See? I'm a giant fishing pole. Oh. Alright. So we come over here. 
and we face the boss of Ordon Village. Sarah's cat. Ha! 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 Yeah, I hit him! Oh, yeah! Anyway, we just do this. And wait for it to go down. This is a really cheap run. One fishies. Fishy. Fish on. See, when he just holds it up. You're not supposed to do that. Yeah, got a gringill. Heart. You want me to catch you another fish? I can do that. Okay, there. And it just sinks down and I got a fish on. Oh, ew. Seriously? <laughs> Sink. There we go. Anyway, guys, it's been 20 minutes, uh, 20 minutes, and in the next episode, we'll get the slingshot. So, I am Dark Ace signing out, and after this cutscene, I'll end off the episode. That's so cool. Bye!